Okay, so for all of you that watched my last video, which had nothing to do with what I'm going to show you today, or for any of you new time viewers, what I'm going to show you today is my cichlids and my new cichlid tanks. So, okay, I need to show you the first tank that they were in, but it grew so much algae that I didn't change it. So, alright, here we go. Okay, so as you can see, this tank is definitely full of algae. I just transferred them today to a little 10-gallon because, as I will show you later in the video, I have a much larger 38-gallon for them to go into. But right now, it happens to be cycling. So, this tank I am going to totally clean out and let cycle as well. So, I will go show you the tank that they are currently in. It does have a little bit of algae. But I have my Pleco, and I also have a catfish in there to help clean up the algae so that I don't have to feed the Pleco algae wave. So this is this little 10 gallon that I am holding them in. I will hold them in here for probably about, I'd say, three to three and a half weeks because I've been cycling my tank for about three or four days now, my big 38 gallon. And I don't know if you can see, they're all hiding in this little cave, my two Jack Dempsey's, my Green Terror, and my Pleco, which for my 38 gallon, I plan on getting a, fem a male Green Terror because I have a female right now, and two um, Black Convicts, hopefully a male and female because my 38 gallon will be big enough for them to breed in. So, as you can see, there is algae for the Pleco and the catfish to sort of nibble on for them to um, have some food without me wasting my algae wafers, which I will put in my new cycle tank. So, now I'm going to show you my 38 gallon before it is done. And hopefully, after that, in about three to four weeks I will show you a new video of when the fish are in there so this right here is what I think is greatness of my um, third 38 gallon tank I really saved a lot of money I want to thank Petco for the great assistance and the great value that we saved on this it came with a stand heater and an aquarium filter it is very good 38 gallon tank. Hood also included with flush fluorescent lights. I bought the gravel I mixed red with this sandish looking gravel and grayness. And I bought the plants. Good price on them. And that tree in the middle is for my cichlids to travel in and out because as you could see when as they were in the 10 gallon they loved to be in that little tree log thing. So and they will dig their nests and stuff within the plants. I'm g planning on getting more plants to like put right next to each other for them to um, breed in because they love to breed in that and they will all be very protective of their eggs so that maybe I'll get some baby cichlids. So this is Adam. I'll be signing off right now but I'll have another video for you three to four weeks from now showing you this tank cycled. As you can see it is kinda cloudy and when I make that next video, you'll be able to see the awesome background that I have. Alright, Adam, signing off.